Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Uh, this is Minister Paul in Northern California with Righteous Cry Ministries. Righteous Cry from Psalms 34. Um, I may even put a link to that. It's 12.55 uh, uh, a.m. on April 15, 2013. Um, you, you just see the sky in the background. Anybody remember this growing up? Um, I'm going to, you know, I, let me just tell you what happened tonight. Um, I tried to put together, come back to that. I'm in no rush. Trust me. Watch, the, watch around the wall right here. I tried to make a, uh, should be a folder open or something there is. Thank you, Jesus. I tried to make a video at, um, from the morning. It was a chemtrail spray. And then when the, the sonic undulations, the TTA, what they call infrasound, you know, first the, chem, first the planes pour out all these poisonous chemicals on a storm they see coming. The wind modules can go only go back two days, uh, Fox 40 just said. I don't know if that's true or not. But watch this. Um, so what I did was, on the you know, we had a family day this weekend. And uh, we had a bunch of people come down. And so what I did was, my eyes went out there burning. So I, I, I videoed the, uh, the, the, the spraying. And then I videoed. The, them hitting it with the sound waves, microwave, heat, they heat it up, and then I videoed the the final sunset. I'll show you what that looks like kind of quick. See the see the dirt. It's just dirty. So um, so having said that, I com this would this would have been like 25 minutes to put them all together. So what I did was I spent six hours combining them into a 1080p high def uh, four minute video. Uh, YouTube took six hours to edit it. They destroyed the lightning, uh, the lighting, and the audio, and I redid it again for another hour and tried to revert it back to the original. And the thing was so shaky you couldn't watch it. The final thing after seven hours, I could you know I wasn't dedicated to doing it, you know it was just something on the side that I, it was mostly YouTube editing this. Uh, long story short, is that seven hours were wasted. I'm seriously wasted uh, because YouTube ruined my video, and it's unwatchable, and ultimately it was deleted. But I'm not going to stop. You, you, there, there has to be some endurance. Let, let me just show you some stuff. Because tomorrow I'm, I'm coming forward with the message that God gave me. Um, I want to show you that this... Uh, I think this is the spray. I have a... I have a look at this. I don't know how much more. You see it coming up from Beale. It comes up from Beale and goes straight over my house. I mean, I'm trying to get people to wake up. Look at that. Let's go to another one. This one is amazing because... It's 5 minutes and 23 seconds, which is a 7 and 3. I find that astounding. The camera, which was my wife's camera, assigned it a number, which is also a 7 3. 4 plus 2 is 6, plus 1 is 7, is 3. 7 3, 7 3, 7 3. Can this all be a coincidence? No, it's impossible. 
I mean, you could play Powerball every day and win at the odds I'm seeing this thing. So let me show you the sound waves. I'm going somewhere with this. I always am, trust me. So they look at this weird pattern. You ever seen it? That's not a cloud. I mean, the weather may come up with a term for it. They call it a snake rope uh, twist cloud or something. But what I want you to see is the, the spray over the left side is the east. That's the uh, that's the east facing Beale Air Force Base. And there's one actually flying across as I'm videoing it on both sides, east and west. But what, what I want to focus on here quickly is you see the spray. See it flying right there in real time? I mean, there's, there's a, a group of four that will fly for a week straight. What I want you to see is the... And then once they get it all dense and covered with, you see these perfect, you'll see the sound waves, watch. They hit it with sound. You can literally see the frequencies. Um, that's just ridiculous. I don't know if I need to go backwards. Let me see. Is it right in here? One, one, one. Do you see that? I'll do this all night if that's what it takes to get the message across to wake people up. Right there. So now they've now this is not a cloud. This is something that our government is allowing clearly because the F, the FAA don't don't be fooled knows exactly what's flying in the skies, right or wrong. Well, aside from on 9/11, they didn't seem to know. Sorry, I'm just frustrated. See these sound waves? They I mean I could I could spend 10 minutes and show you this stuff, but I want to make a quick video and so they they drop they drop the the chemicals by a plane and then they hit it with these sound waves and this is just rough stuff I mean go to Rev Michelle Hopkins page and just watch for hours and you'll be an expert on this just by watching her videos educate yourself I did and then you see the fallout see it we had to come inside. Our eyes were burning so bad. Now I showed you all that to show you the end result. I've done this four times now. I'm going to show you this news story. Thank you, Jesus. Wake up my wife again. I have such a patient, loving wife. My volume thing keeps disappearing, so um, ain't nothing stopping me, saints. This is this happens three times a day where my volume icon disappears. My computer locks up. We press it on. Listen to this, and then ask yourself: When you were a kid, were you told that the air is too poisonous to go outside and play basketball? Let's not be fooled by these lies. God said that we'd be lied to in the end times. Well, we're in the end times and we're being lied to and I'm talking to people and they they don't get it. So I'm going to keep on doing this in, until two thing, one of two things happen. Either they do get it or I go home. That's the only two options. You won't believe this story, trust me. I wouldn't waste your time. Gusty winds moving through the valley are prompting medical officials to warn residents in the area. Chris Beal explains why these winds are raising health concerns. I'll tell you where we are. It is noticeably windy. You check up in the trees here. These leaves are rustling. In the San Joaquin Valley, though, it's more about just the wind. It is what the wind is kicking up. The wind turned into more than just an inconvenience. Although It's not what's kicking up. 
It's what's falling down. There's the lie. Oh, it was an inconvenience. What about the wind? The wind? It's horrible. I don't like it. Just because it messes my hair up. That's why you see it's up. Without getting into the science of particulate matter in general. Let's not get into the science of particulate matter or else we'd have to expose the truth. Be very, listen for yourself. Don't listen to me, listen to him. General, the San Joaquin Valley Air Pollution Control District is worried about what's getting kicked up by the wind and how it affects our health. They say there are a number of harmful right now. These guys out playing basketball in Stockton know what that's about. What are you guys seeing? Uh, just trees moving like crazy, but uh, it won't stop our workout. Yeah. Any dust in the air? Oh, a lot of dust. My allergies are, are killing me right now. Until this wind dies down, county health officials advise avoiding doing any strenuous activity outside. They say that applies especially to kids and the elderly. So this wind is expected to be sticking around. That warning extends through tomorrow night. Well, blacks How do they keep their job? A matter of fact, the Lord told me, I have a friend, he's a news anchor at another station, and he's a Christian, he goes to a church I used to work at. The Lord the, the Lord spoke to me that he's going to step down. Uh, he, he's in a lot of my news stories. He will no longer, he will refuse to lie to the people. I can see the disgust in his face when I watch him and I pray for him. Uh, one more story. Deputies concerned over possible gang war. This is uh, this is kind of my old stomping grounds, and now it's my son's stomping grounds. He lives here. I'm about uh, 30 minutes north of this. Look at this. Three shootings in seven days. believed to be connected to two rival gangs. Now either it's the Norteños and the Serenos or the Crips and Bloods. Anybody living here knows. Um, they're hoping, watch this, it's, it's a level that the department is hoping peaked this week. <laughs> you ain't seen nothing yet. And here's the thing, they know it. They, it's peaked in April. Are you kidding me? April showers bring May flowers. You want to see a peak? You wait till July. We think these two groups that are committed to a war on the streets. If they're committed to a war on the streets, then how did it peak? It says it started, uh, and it even mentions YouTube. This is uh, what they said on a rap on YouTube. We doing hits, homicide. So I wanted you to see that because the Lord showed me this. Now watch. I now have 613 videos. Six plus one is seven. And the three, seven, three. Um, they'll be scoffered to this. Matter of fact, it says it's the third year. And what's it talking about? Extreme violence and earthquake. Repent. So let's look at the earthquake map. It looks like it get the board game Trouble. Where all the colored little dice and stuff. That's what it looks like. Is Jesus Christ Lord and Savior of your life? If not, message me. Turkey, Iran border. And you know, there was one in Crete. I know there's a lot of people that are mocking. Seven, look at this, seven hours ago. Crete. Would you be surprised? That's a seven. Would you be surprised that that's right where God had me draw the, the eastern borders for where he was showing me uh, in a video I just did? And 
the Lord is going to continue to do this. Watch my message tomorrow. Stay safe. And know that this is just the beginning of the sorrows. Hope this hasn't ran too long. But the message is important. And the message is we're going into it. And as soldiers, we need to be strong and endure this battle for as long as it takes. It's 2.7 in L.A. Are you guaranteed to wake up tomorrow if you happen to be watching this tonight? 111 was another thing that I was going to show you. There was a 111. It, it, to me, it's just astounding. It really is. The I sure I'm not. I'm not the only one feeling this way. Is Jesus Christ Lord and your Savior? Help us, Lord. He just. Uh, Look, I just expanded it. There's a helicopter flying over my house at 1, 1 11 in the morning. Hope you can hear it. Listen. Yeah. I don't have to worry about waking my wife up. Military helicopters are. Hmm, that's where it brought my video up. Are these the guys that did it? A, wo a woman, what's this? No, the date don't match. It's Florida, oh, right? Well, Florida. Yeah, I'm not here. The people in my office are the gunshot. Florida. I don't know why, but the Holy Spirit had me not in this uh, video to tell you that you're in danger and the only safety is in Jesus Christ. And there will be a confirmation of this. Seven, three. You know, I asked the Lord, what is it with this seven, three? See it all day, every day. And he always gives me the same answer. answer. He says, warn my people. And the angel said, war. What does Boca Raton mean? It's interesting, is that today's paper? Wonder why the articles. What does. I may not even upload this. I hate wasting team time. Mouth. I do things differently, but. Rat's mouth. Amen, I will. Can everybody else hear from God like amazingly in a way you never have before? I don't even know how to spell it, but I heard it in my spirit. Buenos Aires. I'm sounding the alarm. It's Argentina. Let's go.
go look. Another 30 minute video. It's better than watching TV. Write the date down. Pray for anybody you may know in this area that they would come to repentance. I don't know much about this area, but I pray they come to repentance. Really, I know nothing of this area. University, you know what that means. Airports. Santa Lucia. Anybody understand any of these uh, keywords? Because nobody's really laughing when what the Lord shows me comes to pass. And you have to wonder sometimes when I make this, did somebody watching this have a relative here and just laugh this off and There it is. Eleven. It's the eleventh hour saints. There's the three. One more thing. And I'm done. Once again, the video ran way longer than I wanted it to. You know, this is a job. I meant to put San Jose and it put uh, San Diego. Just following the Holy Spirit. I win warning. Isolated gusts to sixty five miles an hour. That's damaging winds. What's the date on that? Tonight. Look. Until, until tomorrow. Till Tuesday. LA is getting hit with earthquakes in this. Look. Three. Seven. The Bible says we know in part and we prophesy in part. I'm going to show you a couple of scriptures and then I'm going to close because I have a long message to do tomorrow. It may take me two hours. I'm going to put it out in obedience. 1 Corinthians 13 9. For we know in part and we prophesy in part. In other words, I don't know at all, but I'll get parts of it and you may, you may get another part of it. Till that which is perfect is come. In other words, until Jesus returns, we, we can receive prophecy in part. And we can have God's knowledge, heavenly knowledge, in part. One more. Now, if you know anything or want to add anything and you if you think I'm just playing Google Doodle or something you've lost your mind this is the third time I'm coming to you I wonder why that one's in all capitals Look. every fact is to be confirmed by the testimony of two or three witnesses 
So, who gave the warning about everything I'm talking about? Jesus Christ and Nazareth. So what will be established? His word. I sure didn't mean to make an hour video, but the Lord won't let me turn it off. Somebody's in danger. I've never felt this before. Ever. What the heck? Is this Webster's? A pernicious evil influence or agent. American Heritage Dictionary. Having a harmful effect. Look at this. In a gradual or subtle way. <laughs> Takes me back to the beginning of my video of those poisons uh, being dropped in the sky. Shalom. God loves you.